And now your 13 News Now weather forecast, certified most accurate in Hampton Roads. Yesterday, low 40s. Today, well up into the 50s. Tomorrow, 60s. But with that southerly wind comes moisture and a chance of rain. But as I mentioned, right now, great uh, visibility. That continues into the overnight. So what time do you need to be uh, outside tomorrow if you want to miss the rain? Best chance is morning and even actually into the afternoon. We don't expect a whole lot out there. There's nothing in our immediate area. But look out to the west near South Boston. That is moving to the east and the northeast very slowly. Right now we're down to 39 degrees. That's about as low as we're going to go. We're going to hold there and then go up a little bit late tonight as the wind begins to shift. Winds right now are out of the northeast pretty light, six miles per hour. So tonight, again, we're going to average it out to 40. Other spots are still in the 40s, thickening clouds, becoming quite breezy. That wind switching to southeasterly. Notice then overnight we keep those readings not only steady, but even bring them up a few degrees in areas right near the water, especially while inland spots will still make the upper 30s. We start off with a little bit of maybe hazy sunshine if we're lucky, and then we start to see the clouds thicken. Very minimal chance of rain in the morning or even on into the midday. The best chance midday, in fact, will be to the west. Most of tomorrow you're going to get by without any rain. It is not until later in the afternoon and really, especially during the evening that we see those bands of showers and even a couple thunderstorms potentially moving in highs in the 60s. We fall back into the 50s then during the evening and by 1230 at night, the high temperature for the next day is going to happen for Thursday. Your highs are going to be around midnight. Mid 50s down to the south, near 50 or upper 40s here in the immediate area, and then lower 40s to the north. Readings just fall the rest of the night, and then they continue to basically hold in the 30s for most of the day then on Thursday. Some inland spots will make a little bit milder 40s, but most of us are going to hold in the 30s. And then Thursday night, if you're heading out, you're going to need the warm winter jacket as it will start cooling back down through the 30s and into the 20s, in fact, for Thursday night and into Friday morning. Here is that moisture I pointed out, already working its way up towards South Boston. Most of that is going to miss us off into Central Virginia. So for tonight, thickening clouds, slight risk of a shower if you're watching us from way out near I-95 or I-85. Uh, low temperature again, holding pretty close to 40 degrees. Tomorrow, 65 scattered showers. The best coverage will be late and in fact very late. So a lot of tomorrow that 70% is not how much of the day it's going to rain. It's what your chances are in your given neighborhood or city of seeing rain by evening. And that's again going to be very late in the day that we get that rain. Only 39 for the high Thursday and then we start back up again. Almost 70. Well in fact it will be 70 by next Sunday. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday should be pretty wet as well with a stalled frontal system. All right. All right. Thank Thanks, you. Jeff.